DeMarcus Cousins made two tie-breaking free throws after retrieving a Kevin Durant missed three-pointer with 5.4 seconds remaining Sunday night, allowing the Golden State Warriors to survive a three-point shooting assault by the Miami Heat for a 120-118 victory in Oakland, California. February 10, 2019, Oakland, California, USA, Golden State Warriors forward Kevin Durant, 35, follow his shot against Miami Heat forward Justice Winslow, 20, as he scores during the fourth quarter at Oracle Arena. Mandatory credit, Kelly L. Cox, USA Today Sports The game marked the final Oakland appearance by Heat standout Wayne Wade, who contributed 10 points, 6 rebounds and 9 assists to a remarkable Heat effort. Kevin Durant led all scorers with 39 points. Klay Thompson backed Durant with 29 and Stephen Curry had 25 for Golden State which won its fourth straight. Josh Richardson recorded season highs in points with 37 and three-pointers with eight for the Heat, who are coming off a narrow loss at Sacramento on Friday. The on-waiters also had season bests in points, 24, and three-pointers, 6, for the Heat, the only team in the league with a winning record on the road and a losing record at home. Kings 117, Suns 104 rookie Marvin Bagley 3 scored a career-high 32 points as host Sacramento coasted past Phoenix. Bagley shot 10 of 15 from the field and 11 of 13 from the free-throw line to eclipse his previous high of 24 points which he recorded Monday in Sacramento's win over San Antonio. Buddy Heald chipped in 18 points while Bogdan Bogdanovich added 14 for the Kings. Devin Booker collected 27 points and 8 rebounds in his return from a two-game absence due to a hamstring injury for the Suns, who have lost 14 in a row. Mavericks 102, Trailblazers 101 rookie sensation Luka Doncic scored 28 points, with 5 coming in the decisive final 227, to lead Dallas past visiting Portland. Doncic scored 13 points in the fourth quarter, a stanza in which Dallas trailed 96-81 with 10.43 to play. Portland built that lead on Damian Lillard's incredible 21-point third quarter, all of which came in the final 5-19 of the period after Dallas came back from a 10-point halftime deficit to tie the game at 67. Newcomer Tim Hardaway Jr., acquired in the deal with the New York Knicks along with Chris Dapps, Porzingis, scored 24 points on 9 for 18 shooting. Dwight Powell had 13 points off the bench and Dorian Finney-Smith added 11 points and 6 rebounds. 76ers 143, Lakers 120 Joel Embiid scored 37 points and grabbed 14 rebounds to lead host Philadelphia to a high-scoring win over Los Angeles. It was the 23rd game for Embiid this season with at least 30 points and 10 rebounds, the most such games by any Philadelphia player since Charles Barkley had 27 in 1987-88. Tobias Harris added 22 points and J.J. Redick had 21 for the Sixers, who won their second game in a row. Kyle Kuzma led the Lakers with 39 points while JaVale McGee added 21 points and 13 rebounds. LeBron James contributed 18 points, 10 rebounds and 9 assists. Magic 124, Hawks 108 center Nikola Vucevic scored 19 points to lead 7 Orlando players in double figures in a win over host Atlanta. Vucevic was 8 of 13 from the field and added 12 rebounds. The Magic also got 18 points from Terrence Ross, 17 each from Jonathan Isaac and Evan Fournier, 14 points from DJ Augustin and 12 from Aaron Gordon, who played despite a sore back. Wessa Wundu added 10. Augustin played a flawless floor game, handing out 10 assists and not committing a turnover. Alex Len scored 16 points off the bench to lead Atlanta, and John Collins and Kevin Herter added 15 apiece. Collins, playing despite a sore right knee, added four rebounds for the Hawks, who have lost three straight overall and five consecutive home games. Field Level Media